Let's take a look at how the overvoltage protection works on the 8800. The Zeo 8800 uses a differential sense line. That way you can monitor right at the point of load or across the output capacitor for the power supply. With it, it's continuously monitoring, always looking for an overvoltage or an undervoltage event and responding right away. Now what will occur is the device is completely configurable. So if you have an output voltage and you suddenly have an event like an overvoltage spike, the device will immediately shut off per the response fault. Now after that point in time, it's completely configurable on where you'd like it to do. For instance, the device can stay off permanently or it can wait a fixed amount of time that's adjustable and then try to come back up through a soft start time and regulate the output voltage. If the fault still persists, the device of course at some point in time will shut down as soon as it detects that and it will try the retry path all over again. Now every one of those parameters is individually adjustable per the two different output channels. So the number of times you want it to try and retry, the actual delay time, all of this can be individually set. And all this information is within the data sheet in the PMBUS command sections in the back. And the nice thing about this part is it can all be programmed into the device at startup or prior to mounting on the board.